Hey guys, it's Tuesday. Today we're going to jump into another oil from the ancient oils of scripture. All right, welcome back. Today we're going to talk about galbanum. I don't know why I'm singing, but yeah, we're going to talk about galbanum. It's a fancy name for fancy oil from the ancient oils of scripture. We're going to jump into this. Each week we're jumping into one of the oils, one oil at a time, every Tuesday until we've gone through the kit. So right now we're doing galbanum. And uh, yeah, I've got a link to the video where I went through the whole oils, the whole oils, the whole kit, and smelled each oil and shared with you my initial thoughts as I unboxed it. I will link it down below. And um, of course I'll have a playlist listed so you can watch all these once they're all done too, so you can check them all out. So the kit, if you want to get it, is $295 if you want to buy it retail and $224 if you're buying wholesale. So it's worth it if you sign up with Young Living to get it on wholesale. Better yet, save up your essential rewards points and get it for free like I did. I didn't pay a penny for this thing, so that's pretty cool. Now, galbanum is one of the oils in the kit and it's on the pricier side. You're not gonna get this one for free unless you use your points. It is $72.04 if you buy it retail and you're gonna get it for $54.75 if you're buying it wholesale. So, uh, it's supposed to be an earthy aroma. Let's check it out. I have not smelled it. Oh, it's a little bit hard to open. I think that's because it's steam distilled from resin. Whoa, yeah, it smells like grass. <laughs> yep, it smells like dirt and grass. Galbanum. Do you have galbanum? What do you use galbanum for? So it's used in the ancient temple ritual incense anointings associated with springtime that is very interesting it supports your immune system your respiratory circulatory and other body systems um, it also can aid in trouble and matured skin fascinating huh yeah it's a little bit tougher to open sometimes my frankincense can get that way but yeah it's steam distilled from the gum resin derived from the stems and the branches uh let's see it's from the plant origin is Iran, um, and it has a ton of uses. If you want to find it in some other products, it's in Exodus 2. It's in Gathering and Gratitude and Highest Potential. Now, I have Gathering and Gratitude, and um, if I'm not mistaken, I think Geranium might be in there too, and that has the same type of scent to me. It smells very earthy is the best way to put it. That's the aroma. It's found in Exodus verse, or chapter 30, verse 34. And the Lord said unto Moses, Take under the sweet spices, uh, stacked and onica and galbanum, these sweet spices and pure, with pure frankincense of each, shall there be a like weight. So it's pretty cool. What I really want to encourage you guys as I'm sharing with you a little bit about each oil is to... Google them and see if you can find some literature. I'm sure it's on Amazon. There's a book you can look for that talks all about these healing oils of the Bible. There's all kinds of information out there, but I want to encourage you to do your own research. There's only so much I can say when it comes to some of these oils because of um, sharing compliantly, just making sure I'm following the guidelines. But I just want to say this oil is incredible and it's one that should be in your household. So do your own research and share with me in the comments down below how do you use galvanum and do you own it? Do you not own this one yet? The best way to get it is really in the kit. That way you can try a variety of different oils. All right. Thanks guys for watching and I will see you in the next video, which should be Thursday, but I will also have more videos on Tuesdays about the oils from scripture. All right. Bye guys.